gosh. I don't know what the fuck I was thinking. Oh, look at the wall. Whoa. Is somebody gonna come out of there? Oh, shit! I can't wait to try out Trapping 2. All right, ladies and gentlemen, this is Proto Dead, and I'd like to welcome you back to another Let's Try Out video. It's been a while since the last one, and uh, I figured I'd go ahead and hit another demo. I normally don't do demos, but uh, today I want to do one because this one's really cool. Reminds me a whole lot of fear and um, kind of that feel you got from the slow-mo and the destruction and all the action that uh, that fear gave us way back in fuck 14 years ago whenever fear came out cool nice zoom out that's interesting we don't see that too often i guess trapang studios Trepang sounds Chinese. This isn't my first time playing this demo. I played through it once before. And uh, I was... I mean, it's simple, but I was pretty impressed with it. Oh yeah, I forgot to mention Crisis. It has a little bit of Crisis influence too with the uh, you got a power up where you can go invisible like the Predator or whatever. Crisis suit lets you go invisible. I guess that guy was supposed to blow your brains out and he missed. What the fuck's going on here? Wake up, chicken shit. Danger. Authorized personnel. Keep the subject restrained at all times. That's me. Security is not responding. We're moving to investigate. Oh, hell yeah. Love the body physics. That shit's great. Yeah, so apparently these dudes were killed by the uh, the little video we just saw. I thought that was maybe not really story related, but just like kind of some flavor or whatever. <laughs> Fuck yeah. Knock these bodies all around. Water, 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 no water. Oh, I gotta crouch, huh? <laughs> gotta go through the vent. Control, vault security is KIA. Subject 106 has escaped. Shadow stealth. Dot appears in center screen when you are shadow. Enemies can no longer spot you. Will take longer to spot you. Fuck. I need to brush up on my reading skills. Oh, hey. I like how your legs have physics in this world. Nothing to loot, nothing to loot. Fuck that chair. Fuck this chair, too. I'm a fucking maniac. Somebody restrain this man. He's going crazy. He's kicking buckets everywhere. Hide in the darkness, it says. No, shit. Don't let him get away. I guess I'll go through this door. Oh, 
Okay, so we got a normal little indication of uh, bad guys being around. Oh, shit, they saw me. I can't run. So what the fuck am I supposed to do? Green light? I bet I'm supposed to go this way. Good thing they uh, their, their aim is shit. Oh, fuck. This way. Don't let them get away! Alright, cool. So, uh, you know, tropey ass air vents. Locked. Can't go through there. Uh huh, uh huh. These guys are dead. Station, do you have eyes on His leg's off. Security station, respond. What, what the fuck? Oh, that motherfucker's brain's out. Station is not responding. And he got an eyeball hanging out, visible. Um, somebody get these fucking cuffs off of me, shit. Cool. Here we go. Now it's time to rock and roll. To roll and rock. Left mouse button to fire the weapon. Like that. Okay. Okay, space bar to jump. Cool. Thanks for letting me know. It's locked. So I can finally sprint. That's gonna, gonna feel really good. Um, hmm. There was no sound effect on that gunshot just now. I wonder if that was a movie mistake. Oh wow, he dropped a, a magazine. How cool. Left all to slide. Oh shit. I didn't even have to do a sprint to do that. Okay, so left thought just makes you slide. You can just <laughs> You can even slide backwards. Uh, let me walk backwards. Slide backwards. Holy shit. Wow. <laughs> okay. So yeah, that's a that's a lot of fun. Supposed to go through here? No. Well, I guess I'm supposed to jump down here. Hyphen is the flashlight. That one. Got it. I bet you're wondering why I have mapped the hyphen as my flashlight. I'm not going to tell you. Alright, so I'm ready to start, like, capping fools. Blasting fools. Shit, I better watch out. Check the Crouch to move silently, but I won't need to. Nice. What, where's my aim down sights? Do I not have aim down, down sights? What the hell? Whoa, 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 whoa. Okay, melee weapon. Oh, I've already got my powers. Damn, they hadn't even talked to me about that yet. So if I press E, I'm going to go invisible until my power runs out there on the cursor in the middle of the screen right there by the uh, the uh, reticule <laughs> alright fast paced action where are these motherfuckers at come on give me a better gun for fuck's sake slide up no Fuck. Left all left all's kind of hard to get to. I'm 
Let's do some slow mo. Right about now. Bullet time. Hell yeah. Oh gosh. Not my best performance. There we go. <laughs> Here we go. Let's do this in slow motion. Oh, I flung him into the wall. Uh, <laughs> all right slide up the stairs let's move to the next area no is there no ADS like what what the hell I guess not. I mean, I don't know, dude. That's a shotgun. Spaz 12. grenades. I don't have any. <laughs> yeah, the slow-mo is fucking fantabulous. Oh, that's a rib cage. I think I just blew out of somebody. A uh, whole lung. Uh, I blew a whole lung out of some poor motherfucker. You know, these guys are just like got their brains flopping all over the place. For me to play with, Oh, dude. Like, just imagine. Just imagine if you had enough dexterity in your fingertips. How you could just rip roar through this hole. Like, everything. And just be decimating, cloaking, you know, sliding across the ground. Flinging bodies in the air, confusing the enemy, blowing their fucking lungs out. Kicking their brains around. Slow-mo machine gun into all of them. Well, I think I made a mistake. There we go. Trying to get that fucking fire extinguisher to explode. Whoa! That's cool. Hell yeah. I would like to see more debris like flying out of the everything like and then clouding the room with like dust and shit that's still settling. Uh, the slide the slide knocking shit out of the out of the way just doesn't get old, man. I mean that's just I mean I hate to be like a little kid just playing with dead bodies and stuff. because uh, you know kids play with dead bodies a lot, but you know what I mean. I mean fuck. Uh, maybe the final product, since this is just a demo, maybe the final product isn't necessarily meant for us to be able to like slide kick jiggly brains around and uh, and, and enjoy that sort of fun. Uh, but uh, I like it right now, I'll tell you that. I don't know if ammunition is a problem in this game. 
I wonder if it's more of like, uh, what kind of weapon do you want to choose to use right now? And less like, you gotta be swapping them out because you're running out all the time. Nice to see a little stamina bar there, I guess. They're gonna introduce maybe a new game mechanic sometime soon. Did I already come through here? Or is this, this is like the aftermath of the other person that rescued me, I guess. Nice to see that the uh, lights shut off when you shoot them, uh, you know. BSG escape from Tarkov. You could do, you know, take some take some notes here. You can actually shoot the lights out. What's up with this dude? He's got a sword in him. I don't think I got this far in the demo the first time when I tried this out. It must be the Gray Fox from, uh, you know, Metal Gear Solid. Syndicate coin, John Wick. Give me the fucking sword, please. Okay, so I can't kick over his dead body, whatever. Oh, fuck, that bugs me out. Okay, don't do that again. I need a grenade, is what I fucking need. Fuck that person's laptop. <laughs> I can just hear all the fucking bodies flopping in the background. Yeah. Nice. So that light is shoot outable too. Come on, BSG. How come you can't do the same thing with Escape from Tarkov? Oh my gosh! I don't know what the fuck I was thinking. Oh, look at the wall. Whoa. Somebody gonna come out of there? Oh, shit! He got you now, bitch! That's my gun. Yes. Now that is what I am talking. <laughs> so that's just like from the Matrix, man, where they're shooting those pillars up at the end. Uh, when Neo was going to rescue, you know, Morpheus. I love it. Um, so I don't have very much of this rifle ammo, it looks like. I think I got enough to move forward. Yeah, I'm feeling pretty satisfied. I don't know what my... I guess the blue... Uh, the blue bar is armor at the bottom and my health is in green. I'm just now noticing. So health hasn't really been an issue, I guess, up till now. Where is the way out? Light. If, if video game logic has, has given me any knowledge, the, the, 
the light should be the way I go out. So that's where the light's at. Maybe I just need to hit the button. That's gotta be it. No. 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 Yeah, what the fuck? I guess I'm a slow learner. I'm just a dumbass. Um, are we gonna? Oh, shit. Oh, my God. What the fuck? Not as simple as I thought it was gonna be. Yeah, I really need to start using fucking this slide offensively. Jesus. I don't know what I was thinking that whole time. Jesus, I made that so much harder than it had to be. Did I win? Did I did I did I get seek seek the objective and finish it? What am I supposed to do here? I feel like I'm frantic. I need like a health pack or something. Grenades! Oh look! Finally! Alright. Um Grenades explode when on impacting enemies or when shot. I'm guessing it means in the air. Boom, health, good. Intel Read in my database. Okay, so there must be other rooms that's got Intel that maybe I can indulge in. Hey, look. Just like I was saying. I can read in my database. Which basically means at my leisure. Oh, a silence pistol. Yeah. I want to play with the silence pistol for a second. Okay, so the shit's going to hit the fan any second. Time to John Wick these motherfuckers. Oh shit! What am I doing? Uh. Not good enough. Oh, shit. Yeah, I might need to get my rifle back. <laughs> okay, yeah, let me come back here and get this rifle. Wait a minute, where is it? Here it is. What is motherfuckers at, man? Damn. Which way to go? This way? No, I killed people in this room. It's not this way. It's not that way. Maybe it's this way. Call me John Wick, where I come from.
I love it. What the hell was that bench back here? What is this supposed to do for me? Hold to customize weapon. Suppressor. Boom. Laser. Yes. I had no idea. Can you do it with both? Like you can this you can customize any weapon. Okay, I can put a laser on this too. Okay, cool. Cool, cool. So so far we've only seen four different weapons. I mean, it's a pistol with a suppressor on and off, shotgun, a long rifle and a submachine gun, right? Yeah. Yeah, okay. So on to the next area. Totally blast people. We need to totally blast people. I feel like I'm not going the right way. Which way is it? This way. I feel like I've just turned myself around completely. Is this the way I came? I feel like this is the way I came. Yes. This is absolutely the way I came. Okay, so down this way. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's what makes sense. Point of no return. You can't go back up there. Yeah. Alright. See ya. Peace out, bitch. I like it. Whoa, 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 whoa. Nice night vision goggles, man. I mean, that's obviously some high fantasy shit right there, but it looks pretty fucking cool. Yeah, I mean, so a lot of this game really does remind me of Fear and a little bit of Crisis. Um, although, hey, you're gonna hate me for saying this, but I've never fucking played Crisis before. So I'm gonna I'm gonna get around to playing Crisis finally. But I mean, I obviously know of Crisis quite a bit because everybody talks about it. So, um, I think there's more to the demo. Um, I don't know if there's any other weapons in the demo, if there's any other gameplay mechanics, if there's like lock picking or, you know, whatever, boss fights. I'm not sure what Trepang has got in store for us, but um, so far I'm really liking the atmosphere. I'm liking how quick it is. I like the, uh, the, the gunplay being simple and arcadey and uh, holding two weapons at a time. I dig all that shit. Um, so I'm going to transition into reading the words of the developer right now. We're going to see what the developer is advertising for their game. As you guys know, a Let's Try Out video is a part Let's Play. There's going to be some commentary in here, a part tutorial you learn as I learn as I play the game, and part first impressions, because a lot of these games I've never played before. And uh, you get to go through, step through all the problems that I step through, and then hopefully we come out the other side learning a little bit. And kind of a part review, because I try to rehash a little bit of my opinions at the end of the piece after we read the words of the developer we can try to make a decision whether they're shoveling us a load of bullshit or if they're spot on honest and it seems to make a lot of sense with what they're trying to uh, the product that they're trying to produce and if you want to spend your hard-earned money on it because at the end of the day i'm trying to give you an honest presentation of the first 30 minutes or so of a video game really is that way we can make a sound judgment on it so Let's read the words of the developer. Trepang 2. Become the ultimate badass in Trepang 2, a gory action-packed first-person shooter set in the distant future. Unleash all hell on your enemies, dodge bullets, and leave a trail of destruction in this hardcore and frantic shooter. This is developed by Trepang Studios and published by Team 17 Digital. And of course, this is a gory, violent action, first-person shooter, bullet time, indie 
uh, a shooter game, first person, uh, a single player game. And um, you can download the demo that I just played here on Steam. Uh, it, it's going to release sometime in 2022 as of the publication of this video. This says here that you play as an escaped soldier who has no memories of their distant past, but is infused with supernatural abilities. Revenge is on your mind, you'll stop at nothing to get what you want. Deliver devastating punches, sneak around in the shadows, wield explosive weapons, and give the bad guys a taste of their own medicine. A mysterious group breaks you out from a heavily guarded black site. Your memories are gone, but your combat abilities are enhanced far beyond human limits. Fight back find the truth and face a threat even deadlier than yourself. First person guns and melee attacks that leave bloody bullet holes on human enemies and blood splatter on nearby surfaces. Powerful weapons often dismember enemies, separating limbs from their body or destroying their bodies entirely, leaving only bloody remains, which we saw. So in, in the demo here, as you can see, it's very bloody, very gory. There's a uh, viscera and internal organs that fly around out of the bodies as you blow them up and uh, now that I speak of it kind of reminds me of some Soldier of Fortune 2 double helix. Uh, I remember the dismemberment um, back in the 90s when this game when that game first came out it was like unprecedented levels of gore and dismemberment it was like uh man some of the stuff dreams are made out of and it feels like Trepang Studios is apparently trying to really uh, capitalize on the fast-paced, frantic, and phrenic action of the Fear games. And maybe it's not so horror-centric, because the Fear games, the first Fear game especially, tried to be cinematic in kind of the delivery of the horror stuff. Um, but it's, it's a little bit more arcadey and action-packed. Um, than that so uh, a little bit like takes a little bit of spices and a little bit of ingredients from I guess all these previous games you know the gore and dismemberment from Double Helix uh, Soldier of Fortune 2 and in uh, and, and, and some of the ideas of the super suit and shit from Crisis so we'll see when the when the final game comes out but right now I mean this is fucking cool I mean it's silly it's dumb um, it's super fast it's I mean, easy on the eyes. I, I think it's a whole lot of fun. I really liked it. Um, can't wait for the final game. So, so yeah, tell me what you think in the comments down below. You know, leave me a comment or whatever. Let's start a little discussion about this. And, uh, uh, hey, I'm Proto-Dead. You know the drill. Thanks for making it all the way to the end of the video. And since you're here, why don't you go ahead and leave a like on the video if you liked it. Dislike it if you disliked it. Sound off in the comments below about any other opinions that you might have. I appreciate you stopping by. Subscribe for future content. Share my video with a friend if you can. It helps me out a whole lot. This is Proto Dead saying I'll see you in the future.